Hello Hawks, today I'm going to show you how to enable the international keyboard on your Chromebook so that you can type using the Spanish language um, for your Spanish classes. So down here in the bottom right hand corner, you'll notice that there's your, your icon and the time. We're going to click over here and you'll see that a menu pops up. We want to click in this bottom left hand corner and go to our settings menu. You'll notice a lot of options pop up, but we really want to focus on the device heading and we are going to want to click on keyboard settings. From here, we're going to choose the last link or option, which is change language and input settings. The next step is to make sure that there is a check mark next to this show input options in the shelf. This will make it easy to switch back and forth between the Spanish keyboard and the English keyboard. Over on the right side of this box, we want to also make sure that there's a check mark next to US International Keyboard. We'll now click Done, and we can get out of this box as well. You'll notice that in the bottom right hand corner, you'll now have a symbol that says US. When we want to switch back and forth between the English um, keyboard and the Spanish keyboard, you'll click this. So to make it Spanish, I will click US International Keyboard. And what we have just done is given us the ability to make all of these letters that are blue. How we would do this is we would click the right alt button. So it's on the right of your, of your space bar. And you would hold that down and then click the button that you wanted. So if I wanted to make an N, with the little squiggle above it, I would hold down the Alt button and then click the letter N and it will produce this lowercase letter. If I wanted to make a capital N with the squiggle above it, I would hold down the right Alt button, click Shift as well, so you would hold down both of these, and then it will push the N button and it will give you an uppercase N with the, the squiggle above it. So this is what we have done and um, to get this image right here, all I did was go up to Google and typed in International Keyboard Chromebook. So you can see all of the letters and symbols and how to get them just by looking at this image. But if you have any other questions about it, you can feel free to stop by the library and we can help you out with that as well. I have a feeling you guys will figure this out quite quickly. So just as an example, I'll show you in a Google Doc. I'm going to hold down my right alt key and qu click my question mark button and you'll see that it produced an upside down question mark which is used in the Spanish language. Um, I will go ahead and type out a little example. Again, I'm holding the alt key and pressing the letter O and it put the O with the um, little accent mark above it. Holding down the alt key, click the letter A and I was able to write in Spanish properly. So to switch back and forth again um, to our English keyboard, we would come down to the right hand, loan, right hand corner and click International and click US Keyboard. And now I'm all set for my English classes. So it's really easy to toggle back and forth um, for your Spanish assignments. Hope this helps you guys. And if you have any questions, feel free to stop by the library. Thanks.